Hello Taurus, welcome to Sidekick Tarot. I'm Ryan, thank you for being here. This going to be a general reading so everything may not resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, and Val 53 Tarot, which is read for you as well. Thank you. Okay, let's see what's going on. <clears throat> whoa, 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 whoa. What a way to start, Taurus. What a way to start. What is going on here? Um... Wow. Mm -hmm. Ultimately, whatever is going on, Taurus, you're kind of showing me this overall energy of you feel completely at loss for ideas. You're kind of saying nothing feels right, nothing feels correct, nothing is kind of calling me, and I'm not really gravitating towards anything. Um, I, I don't even know, I don't know, like I said, it's like you're kind of showing this energy of just completely baffled, completely baffled, but you know you got to choose or do something here. Like you're really trying to kind of fill things out, but you're kind of just like, everything, you literally, you're kind of giving the energy of like everything sucks. It's like, okay. Goodness gracious, Taurus. What is that? Um, that's difficult. That is a difficult one. You're kind of, geez. You're kind of showing me that it's like, um, there's this overall energy of it feels like something is rocking your world. Something is completely shaking you up. Um, It's almost like you're kind of like, you're kind of having this um, expression of like, um, just complete shock, like utter shock as to what is taking place or what you're in a sense even witnessing taking place regarding your situation, your circumstances. So much to the point where you're kind of like saying, um, I need to assess my life and everything that's going on immediately. Oh, wow. And that's okay. Taurus, is, is that what you chose to do? I don't exactly know. Um, there is definitely some sort of argument or complications going on at home, your living situation. You're ultimately showing me, yes, there is a living situation or a possible foundation, but you're kind of like saying it's what's going on, let's just say within that living situation or home life, that there is some sort of conflict. Oh, geez. This is an argument. This is a fight. This is a fight between you and someone. But that's what's very fascinating is it's almost like, how do I say this? Um, you're showing me this energy that you're, how to express this? You're upset, you're, you're mad, you're infuriated. You're seeing red, Taurus. You're seeing red today and you're kind of like, I am the bull, I'm going to give you the horns and I feel okay with that. I'm, I'm happy about that. You're gonna kind of show me this energy of, you may be starting some sort of conflict or maybe someone's starting conflict with you, but I don't, I don't know what this is about, but whatever is taking place, I kind of feel like you're kind of like, well, this is my home, this is my place, um, this is who I am, this is me, and you're kind of showing me this energy of like, well, I'm gonna stand up for me, I am who I am, and you're kind of like showing me that it's like it is what it is, and there's this energy of, it's fascinating because there is this energy of kind of like trying to kind of like take it easy and recover from this, 
and you're kind of like saying, I need to do whatever I need to do for me because there is some sort of new emotions and feelings here kind of coming up and I don't exactly know what that's about, but. The pendulum. You're doing the pendulum swing here, Taurus. You're doing the pendulum. Whatever this conflict or argument or disagreement or miscommunication is between you and someone, I feel like you're kind of like, well, this is energy of you're kind of swinging over to the other side. And it's like, you know, the, the what's I call the scale of love to hate. Love to hate or whatever they, you know, they typically say with that, you know, that saying. Um, you're kind of like, well, if this is taking place, it's kind of like energetically pushing you over to here. And I feel like whatever this love is, I feel like it's for someone because you're ultimately saying, well, um, it could be for yourself, it could be for someone else, but I kind of feel like it is for someone else because you're showing me this energy of trying to kind of contain yourself about whatever this is. Even then you're like, I know I need to make changes and I know I, know I need to kind of like figure out where this is going. And I feel like you're allowing your mind to literally drift in a direction away from whatever your current situation or circumstances are. You're, you're drifting, you're drifting. You are, you are willing to work on things though. And I feel like whatever that is, that you are kind of like changing around and shifting around. I feel like it, it's an energy of um, like, what comes, what, what kind of comes to mind? What ideas do you get? Um, you're kind of like going through your memory bank as to, okay, well, is there anything that I used to do or maybe I was more comfortable with doing or maybe felt better? Something that felt a little bit more equal or possibly more give and take and balance, more in flow. And what's fascinating is even though you're a little bit unsure I feel like something of, regarding these changes that you're making is working out for you. Even though you don't know where it's going, um, it's working out for you in some type of way. Ooh. You're kind of, you know, you're, you're emphasizing the message of, I have zero time to waste. I have zero time to waste. Jeez, yeah, there's definitely some sort of communication or contact here between you and someone, but again, whatever is taking place, um, this is a very difficult road to travel. That is for sure. There's some pain here. There's some pain. Yeah. Oh, goodness. You're well aware of it, though. You're well aware of it. Yeah, yeah. You're giving me this message of, I got to do what I got to do for me. I got to do what I got to do for me. And you're kind of like saying, well, again, you're kind of giving me this very matter of fact mindset of perspective of it is what it is. I'm going to make this, you're saying whatever this heartbreak is, you know, you got to take action of some sort. I don't know what that's about, but it's almost like whatever this communication is between you and someone, it creates this pain. And then all of a sudden it's kind of like, then it's like off you go and then you got to kind of like take care of something. I don't know where you're going or what you're doing, um, but you're definitely assessing everything. And you're kind of like, well, is this the direction I'm going? Yep, it is. And so I'm just taking action. Um, okay. Of course, if you are dealing with anyone. Wow. No one shows up, but they definitely are there. Goodbye.